Hey guys, this is David from Omega Engineering. Today I'm going to be showing you how to apply heating tape on a length of plumbing pipe. Why do we use heating tape? Well, it's that time of year where water pipes are being exposed to cold or freezing temperatures. A really good way to keep them from getting frozen is by using heating tape along the length of pipe. The heat tape we're using today has a flexible silicone coating. Uh, it has a thermostat that is preset to 16 degrees Celsius or 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Now that doesn't seem like a lot, but to keep the pipes from getting frozen or to keep them warm enough, that should be good enough for this application. In order for the heat tape to function efficiently, it has to make full contact with the piping along the entire length of pipe. So if you have an older pipe, it's always a good idea to remove any dirt or debris that might prevent contact from the heat tape on the pipe. Now always make sure that the power outlet that you're using to power on the heating tape is GFCI type. Never use an extension cord between the heating tape and the power outlet. Now let's get wrapping. So for this video, we're going to be using uh, electrical tape to attach the heating tape onto the length of copper pipe. So I'm taking a piece of electrical tape and attaching the thermostat onto the end of the copper pipe. Now that we've connected the thermostat to the copper pipe, I am going to go ahead and attach the silicone heating tape onto the copper piping. Now you wanna make sure that there's full contact between the heating tape and the copper piping. You never want any gaps or spaces between the heating tape and the length of copper piping. So once it's all wrapped around, I'm gonna be using another piece of electrical tape and sealing it off in here. So you can wrap this as wide as you want to, but make sure that you don't go below one eighth of an inch between each spiral wrap. Now one thing you never wanna do is to overlap heating tape along the length of piping because that's a major cause of fire hazard. So there you have it guys. The heat tape is tightly wrapped. There is no gaps between the heating tape and the piping. There is no overlaps. So we're ready to power it up, bring on the cold. But seriously though, if you want more awesome videos, feel free to subscribe, comment below on what kind of videos you want to see. And uh, if you have any other technical questions, contact us. One of us would be more than happy to help you out.